हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम टू द चैनल सो हेयर वी आर डिस्कसिंग द क्वेश्चन मॉन्स्टर्स अटैक ऑन कोड फोर्सेज सो द प्रॉब्लम स्टेट दैट यू आर प्लेइंग अ कंप्यूटर गेम करंट लेवल ऑफ दिस गेम कैन बी मॉडल एज अ स्ट्रेट लाइन योर कैरेक्टर इज इन पॉइंट जीरो ऑफ दिस लाइन देर आर एन मॉन्स्टर्स ट्राइंग टू किल योर कैरेक्टर आई एथ मॉन्स्टर हैज हेल्थ इक्वल टू ए आई एंड इज इनिशियली इन पॉइंट एक्स आई एवरी सेकेंड द फॉलोइंग हैपन्स फर्स्ट यू फायर अप टू के बुलेट्स एट मॉन्स्टर Each bullet targets exactly one monster and decreases its health by one. For each bullet, you choose its target arbitrarily. For example, you can fire all bullets at one monster, fire all bullets at different monsters, or choose any other combination. Any monster can be targeted by bullet regardless of its position and any other factors. Then all nine monsters with health zero or else or less die. Then all alive monsters move one point closer to you. Monster to left of you increase their coordinates by one. Right decrease coordinates by one. If any monster reaches your character, you lose. Can you survive and kill all n monsters without letting any of them reach your character? So here the input is. Here t is the number of test cases. We are given two integers n and k. Where k are the number of bullets, and n are monsters. So for every n monster, we have a one to a n. This a one to a n is the power of that monster, and x one to x n is the coordinate of that monster. And the sum of n over all test cases does not exceed three into ten to the power five. So we need to print yes if you can kill all n monsters before they reach your character or no otherwise. So for the first case, you have power as one two three. You are at zero. So let it be you. And monster is at minus one. And then monster is at two. And three. Now you have k equal to two. So you can fire two bullets at a time. So now, as we have two bullets, we fire one bullet at monster one and one bullet at let it be monster three. So. monster one has strength of only one so it dies and monster three is left with strength two monster two is also left with strength two and both of them move one unit closer so this is the case now now again you have two bullets so you hit monster this monster by two unit so this dies but this comes here so what you are left with u m now again two bullets so you can kill this monster easily as only strength two is left for this monster so hence the output yes in this case now let's take the other case we have 1 1 1 1 1 1 here also monster and here also you have monster now you have only one bullet so you can fire only one side so if you fire this side this monster will kill you or if you fire this side this monster will kill you so the solution is not possible hence we output no in this case so basically what we are doing here is for monsters at equal distance on left and right we want our bullets to be equal to the sum of the total strength of both the monsters now to achieve this what you can do you can move all the monsters to the right side and then calculate your answer so suppose 
I have here minus 1 1 and u so what I will do I will do here u and here my monster strength will be m1 plus m2 if my this is m1 and this is m2 so strength of m1 plus m2 will be replaced here since both of them have strength of 1 1 so their strength will be 2 and I have only one bullet as 1 is less than 2 I will output no in this case so like this we can do now let's take another example so suppose I am taking the example of minus 3 minus 2 1 3 and they have power of 3 4 2 5 so I move minus 3 to 3 and minus 2 to 2 so 1 2 and 3 of 1 plus 3 of 2 so here my 3 of 1 is minus 3 which I brought to the right and 3 of 2 is the original third index so the strengths are for 1 the strength is 2 so we have here u then we have strength 2 then for next one which is 2 I moved minus 2 to 2 so it has strength 4 and then 3 is having strength 5 plus 3 so 5 3 that is 8 now how many bullets 10 bullets so we have 10 bullets for each so as 10 is greater than all of them we will output yes indeed no issue it can be handled easily now let's take a case of no so we have both the index positive here in case of any negative which is minus 1 and 1 so it will be u and the strength will be 1 plus 1 which is 2 now we have bullet 1 1 is less than 2 so we output no in this case so I hope you all understand the intuition what we are trying to do because as both of them are at equal distances we are adding them up to make the problem more easier so let's look at the solution now so the code is as follows we take the input vn is my power and xn is my coordinate so I put first all of them on the right so I am adding their strengths actually so minus 3 and 3 the monster on minus 3 and 3 their strengths are added to the absolute of xi absolute of xi means if xi is minus 3 it will become 3 so for index 3 my value will become the power at minus 3 plus the power at 3 so I will get the total power whole on the right I will shift all the power to the right all the monsters to the right now my power is k I start from i equal to 1 to the end y1 because I myself is at 0 so we start calculating this if at any point the power is less than this put all on right then we see out no which means at any point my power is less than the overall power of monster then it will output no else my power will decrease by the amount of power needed to kill that monster and then it will increment by k as mentioned in the question if this condition is not true in any case then we will output yes so this is the whole solution to the problem thanks for watching